With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. PV indicator diagram for a given sample of monoatomic ideal gas is shown in figure. If the average molar specific heat capacity of the system for the process ABCD is XR by 4, then find value of X. So, the average molar heat capacity is given by delta Q upon delta T. That means the total heat exchange during the process upon the change in temperature. So, delta T in this, in this particular process, the initial temperature will be Ta and the final temperature will be Td. So, delta T will be equal to Td minus Ta. Let's say this is equation number 1. Now, let's apply PV is equal to NRT. So, PV is equal to NRT which means PV upon T is equal to NR which means PV upon T is equal to constant. So, at A, at A, the pressure is P0, volume is 2V0, P0 into 2V0 upon temperature Ta. This should be equal to the PV by T at B because it is the same gas. So, Pressure will be P0, volume will be V0 and temperature is Tb. This should be equal to PV by T at C. So, pressure is 2P0, volume is V0. So, 2P0, V0 upon Tc. This should be equal to PV by T at D. So, at D. Pressure is 2P0 and volume is 3V0. So, 6P0 V0 by Td. This means 2P0 V0 upon Ta is equal to P0 V0 upon Tb is equal to 2P0 V0 upon Tc is equal to 6P0 V0 upon T T. Now P0 V0 is constant. So we can cancel that out from all of the four expressions and we get 2 upon Ta is equal to 1 upon Tb is equal to 2 upon Tc is equal to 6 upon T. So that means 2 upon Ta is equal to 1 by Tb which means Ta is equal to 2 times of Tb which means Tb is equal to Ta by 2. This is equation number 2. Similarly 2 by Ta is equal to 2 by Tc. 2 by Ta is equal to 2 by Tc which means Tc is equal to Ta. This is equation number 3. Similarly, 2 by Ta is equal to 6 by Tb. So, 2 by Ta is equal to 6 by Td which means 1 upon Ta is equal to 3 upon Td which means Td is equal to 3 times of Ta. This is equation number 4. Now the work the total heat or the change in the heat during the process ABCD delta Q A B C D will be equal to delta Q A B plus delta Q B C plus delta Q 
C, D. Now, the process A, B, pressure remains constant, which means this process is isobaric. Then, during the process B, C, the volume remains constant, which means this process is isochoric. And during the process CD, the pressure remains constant, which means this process is isobaric. So, for an isobaric process, the change in heat is NCP delta T. For isochoric process, it is NCV delta T. And for isobaric, it is once again NCP delta T, which means NCP delta T means the final temperature minus initial temperature, final state is B, so TB minus initial state temperature TA plus NCV. Once again, final, tem final temperature minus initial, final state is C, so TC minus initial state temperature db plus ncp final state temperature td minus initial state temperature tc which is equal to now we have found out the relation between db and ta tc and ta and td and ta so we can use that now so tb is equal to ta by 2 that means TB minus TA will be NCP minus TA by 2 plus TC minus TB. So TC is equal to TA and TA is equal to 2 times of TB. So, so that means TC is equal to 2 times of TB which means TC minus TB is equal to TA minus TB which is TA by 2 plus NCP TD is equal to 3 times of TA so 3 times of TA minus TC is equal to TA so minus TA which is equal to NCP minus TA by 2 plus NCV TA by 2 plus NCP 2 TA which means NCP times 2 TA minus NCP TA by 2 so that gives us 3 by 2 NCP TA plus NCV TA by 2. Now, in the question it says that this is a monoatomic ideal gas. So, for a monoatomic ideal gas, I can say that CP is equal to 5 by 2 and CV is equal to 3 by 2. R. This was so putting these values, I get N into three by two CP that is five by two R into TA plus CV that is 3 by 2 R 3 by 2 R into TA by 2 that means R times of TA into 15 by 4 plus 3 by 4 equal to R TA upon 18 by into 18 by 4. So this is the value of delta Q. 
I'm considering that this is one mole of gas, so n is equal to one. Now, delta t from equation number one was t d minus t a. So t d minus t a and t d is equal to t d is equal to three times of t a. So three times of t a minus t a is equal to two t a, which means delta q by delta t is equal to eighteen t a into r upon four into two times of t a. T a and t a get cancelled, and we get nine r by four. And in the question, this is given as x r by four, which means x is equal to nine. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.